Hello and welcome back to Environmental Station Alpha. Last time we just dealt with the terrible serpent that was up above. It's now dead. We have the charge shot and we are allowed to no longer be fighting a serpent. It's brilliant. Ow. That hurt. I just slammed my face into a wall. Where are we? The jellyfish chased me all the way here. What vicious creatures! Avoiding them wouldn't be such a problem. Oh yeah, I've been here. I was here when I already had the propeller upgrade. And right, we got another objective, didn't we? Let's check it out. It's all the way up yon in the upper left-hand corner. Very good, very good. We'll head this way. Didn't want to click that again. We're going to head this way and get out of the aquatic sector because I hate it. It's filled with jellyfish. I don't like jellyfish. Mostly just from my experiences with them in this game. But still, they're terrible creatures. And all that they want to do is kill me! Why do you hate me so, jellyfish? What should I do to you outside of kill your mother? Get out of here. Is killing a jellyfish's mother really so bad that all the other jellyfish have to come up and try to kill me? Is it really? I mean, it's not as bad as, like, killing two jellyfish mothers. That's far worse. I mean, they have to put this stuff into perspective, don't they? My goodness. No good. Let's go this way. Hello, jellyfish. Get out of here, jellyfish. I don't like you. I don't like your race. Which is kind of mean. I'm sure jellyfish don't... Oh, I went in here. I'm sure jellyfish don't actually deserve all of the hatred that I'm giving them. And by I'm sure, I mean I'm, I'm not. I'm not terribly sure about that one. I don't like jellyfish very much. They're terrible. Okay, let's go this way. Up here. I believe that over this way will bring us to the exit to this terrible zone that I never want to come back to. But we'll no doubt be forced to at some point. Save so we don't lose progress, because you always gotta do that. You might come to a save station and think, well, I don't need to save right now. I haven't... S is the menu? I didn't know that. I hope I don't continue to accidentally click that, because I don't want to see the map all the time. But anyway, you might come to a save station and think, well, you know, I don't really want to save right now. It's not the best time. But I'm telling you, you're going to regret it if you don't save. It's key to any good gaming experience to save every chance you get. Not every chance, but as many chances as you can. And I mean, look at that. I didn't even break my stride, and I saved. This guy's running like Forrest Gump. He's just going all across the world, not even stopping for anything, not even to save his game. Doesn't care. Oh, yeah. Forgot about this situation. You know what? Maybe we can take out those red blocks. I can't remember what we actually needed to take them out. Not the charge beam. That's for sure. Hello. Nope, that was not the jump button. That was the grapple hook button. Ha! Nope. Okay. Take two. Ja Green stalks, would you just stop? Would you seriously just stop it with your little laser bolts? You don't need to do this. What have I ever done to you personally? Nothing. I mean, you just started shooting at me all of a sudden. If anyone's got problems, it's definitely you guys. Come on now. What's this way? Right, this is this is this place. I remember this place. Remember coming here and being like, what in the heck? I can't do anything here. And now I remember coming back here and being like, oh what the heck? I can't do anything here. It's almost like a deja vu scenario going on here. Where I can't do anything anywhere. It's unfortunate, really. I'm sure we'll find our way out eventually. We have to have what we need to get out. Hello, giant bug. There we go. You got a charge shot to the face, fool. You can't expect to just get away so easily. Maybe I can kill the giant sandworm with... Nope. K 
cannot kill Giant Sandworm with charge shots. That is a fact. Oh, look, we got blue walls. That means that we can shoot them with the charge shot. We just have to evade the sandworm. We'll use all of the amazing skills that we gained from fighting the serpent in order to defend ourselves from this terrible sandworm. No, that wasn't far enough. Apparently we didn't get very good skills. But I'm still not very good at evading it. There we go. Oh, oh. My jumping skills. They've degraded. Boom, you're dead too. Nice, we're out. What a relief. I didn't want to be in there anymore, people. It's a terrible place. As I've said. Uh, we got so little health. Why doesn't any enemy drop health in here? Ah. Uh, no. 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 Okay. It's okay. It's okay. We'll keep it together. No, I'm fine. Okay. We're going to go through that and we're not going to drop into the sandworms pit. And we're not going to take all that damage, and then we're going to be fine. It's going to be perfectly all right. Hello. Whoop. Whoop. Jump. There we go. We know exactly where we're going this time. And we're not going to make any mistakes about it. We're going to be prompt and quick. One minute, we're going to be swinging over the sandworm. The next minute the sandworm will be like, where in the heck are we? And we're going to be in Kentucky. Because Kentucky is just a place to be! Here we go. Whoop. Whoop. There we go. Come on down here, you little spiky bugger. There we go. And you're next. We're actually going to get you guys this time. Instead of missing it. Ha. And a floating amoeba. You think that a floating amoeba can defeat me? You think you're that good floating amoeba? It's not that you're that good. It's that I'm that bad. Don't you worry about that. There we go. Let's see. Whoop. Nice. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, we're getting places. We are getting places. Let's go this way. See what we have over here. It could be anything. Um, but do you know what it was? Take a fine guess. It brought us back to where we were! My god. The audacity of this game to bring me directly back where I came so that I have to do that whole arduous journey over again. Doi! I do not accept such disgusting terms of service. I demand a refund. But I can't have any refund. It's not allowed. I knew what I was getting into when I purchased the product. And they're citing that. They're citing that I was told that this would be the case. Why can't I shoot anything right now? There we go. There we go. And you're next. Oh, the terrible aiming. I just can't deal with it. What is going on? There used to be a time when I could shoot things. But nowadays, that doesn't appear to be that time. Woo! Leaving you in the dust, fool! Woo. Can't... Okay, those we can't hookshot onto. That's what those ones are. So in that case, what is the purpose? What is the purpose of all of this? I don't know. Ah, per oh! Mmm! 
idea had. I think, no, 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 no. Okay, there we go. Okay. This idea is going to work. And if it doesn't, I'm going to freak out. Yep, it's going to work. So now that we've destroyed those blocks, we've got a much lower little platform there. Once I remember the controls, we'll be able to actually execute my plan to do this. Death from above! And by death from above, I mean I'm just running by you. I don't even care. You don't even drop anything. Why would I kill you if you don't even drop anything? Huh. Yep. And last drop. You're dead. Okay. We appear to be in the home of the terrible Metroid Blobs. I prefer, if possible, that you just extricated yourselves from the scenario and really just fuzzed off overall. Just get the gone, you evil Cretans. You are truly evil. You are the scourge of humanity, and I do not appreciate your existence. Oh, look, and there's another one. Hello. Okay. So, we are making progress. However slow, it is steady. Let's see. We're going to have to take out these charred blocks quite clearly, because they exist here for a reason. And I am hypothesizing that their reason is to be destroyed. Which is, really, if that's your reason for existing, that's pretty unfortunate. If you just, like, imagine you're born, you live for a while, and then your parents just go, Well, son, your purpose in life was actually to just be run over by this steamroller. We really needed a test subject for our new human steamroller project. Which I think brings up a lot more questions. And I totally didn't need to do half of what I just did there. It's unfortunate. I mean, your parents have to be quite... How do I put this lightly? Completely psychotic? If they... Um... Who, oh, that, oh, I just went back in. Your parents would pretty much have to be completely psychotic if they birthed you purely for the purpose of testing a new human steamroller design. First off, there's the question of why did they have the idea for a human steamroller? And why do they need to test it? Is this like a market test or something? If it's a market test, who are the people who are accept who are the purchasers of this product? Because that's a bit ridiculous. I don't think that anyone should purchase a human steamroller. That's terrible. What do we have here? Remember that you can skip any dialogue you've already seen by pressing escape or eight on the gamepad. Oh, shut up. I hear, oh, the entire floor falls away. How nice. Okay. So we've made it to a save station in this new and terrible place that we've come into. Filled with amoebas. I don't appreciate amoebas. I really don't like them at all. But it's better than jellyfish, I guess. On some level, at least. Woo! No? Woo! No. Still no. I will get up there, I swear. There we go. You can't stop me. What do we have here? Once the emergency system activated, getting close to the AI mainframe has been nearly impossible. The dozens of blasted the dozens of blast doors guarding its core certainly ensure that no outsiders get in. However, the system is actually connected to a certain security robot. If it were destroyed, the whole intricate security program would be practically crashed. That is really poor design. <laughs> I mean, Come on, dude. If it's that easy to take out your security system, they're just going to get rid of it. That's all they're going to do. They're going to kill that robot, and you're going to be left in the dust being like, oh, my security system is down. 
It was a really big flaw in the system. Probably should have thought about it. Dang you stupid eyes. Get out of here. Forgot about them. Okay. So we just um, teleported our way to a more useful area closer to our destination. Which is up here somewhere. Hello, little worm. I met what must be your older brother. He's a terrible creature indeed. Hello. No, no, shut up. I want that. I just want you dead. There we go. Look at that. It's dead now. Now we need to go to the upper left, so probably this way. Probably consult the map as well. That would probably help. Just a little. Saying probably less would also probably help. Let's see. Yep, we are going the right way. Wait. Wait a second. I'm not sure that we are going the right way, though. Because I think we're going to a boss room that I'm not going to be able to go up. Which is my current goal. Let's, let's just see. Let's just see. Oop. Let's reassess the situation. The boss room right above me is the giant beetle boss, whose room we can't go up through. So we need to go back and to the right. And then we'll be able to get up and back to where we were to begin with. That'll be nice, won't it? I would enjoy that, personally. We'll be back in the very initial areas of the game. We can reminisce about everything we did, which was learn how to use the grapple hook which apparently I don't do very well because I just slammed my head into a mushroom. Back in those times when we didn't even have double jump, which is ridiculous. I mean, think about that. There was a time when we didn't have double jump. Why didn't we come equipped with double jump? Personally, I don't understand that. Can we go through here? We've been through there before. Okay. I will be consulting the map quite a bit, most likely. Because, oh god, poison water! Uh, yeah. Because, we are trying to get from point A to point B. We need to make sure that we go the right direction. And of course, as I said before, saving is key in every situation. So here we save at ye old save station. I remember this save station. You know which save station this is? That one. The one with the secret wall. I love it. It's amazing. We're saved in it. Now if we die some terrible death, probably at the hands of these terrible spiky creatures, it won't be the end of the world. We'll just come back right there. Where are we going? Way upwards. Very, very far upwards. Let's see. What is behind door number two? This room. Another room I remember. As I said, it's a... It's just a walk down memory lane at this point. We haven't been here for ages. Ages upon ages. Hmm. Ha! Huh. We have ascended. Hmm. Huh. Oh, we've already done this before, haven't we? Didn't work out the last time either. Ash, unfortunate. Woo. Okay. It's this way. Anyway. There we go. That one took quite a little while to load. Which is unfortunate. Hello. You know when I was here last? I was here when I didn't have the propeller. And I found falling into the water to be quite cumbersome. Get out of my way, security door. I don't even care. I've got all the security clearance in the friggin' world. Who do you think you are? Are you ready? Boom. Let's make sure we're still on track. Definitely still on track. Oh, but in hindsight, we don't actually strictly know the way back to where we came from, and apparently this is not the right direction. 
Well, bugger. I guess we're gonna have to go back and try that other upward passage, or the passage to the right, most likely. But that can wait till next time. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this, like and subscribe, and we'll continue our adventuring next time as we go through the, uh, as we continue to try to find our way to the objective. Luckily, we've escaped the aquatic zone, so it won't be too terrible. But yeah, until then, thanks for watching, and enjoy the rest of your day.